All right, we're out here at EVET again, the East Valley Institute of Technology. And uh, Rhonda, this is kind of neat because we've talked about the high school programs. Yes. We talked about how those are benefiting the high schools greatly. But you guys are doing something now for adults that you've always done, but now you've really expanded more with their time. Yes, we're really trying to focus on the adult education and the opportunities for our community in adult education. So this floor, for example, that you're on, during the day daytime, it's not used by the high school students. So we are using it for adult students. And behind me, I have the LPN students. And they're here during the day, five days a week, getting their education. And the, this group of students will graduate in April and be able to go out into the workforce to meet those demands we have for healthcare. Yeah, and that's what EVA is all about. It's about helping those expand the, maybe the education they have all or even starting the education they are going to do. Correct. Especially in fields like nursing or in the medical field um, and in different areas, which is great because that's what's needed right now. Correct, so our big focus is right now with our adult education is of course all things health because there's such a crisis of workforce and then our industrial trades, construction, welding, auto, plumbing, HVAC, those other areas that are in high demand that we seem to be lagging behind in Arizona. All right, take us to the program that adult is doing here because again, it's it's a little more advanced than what the high school students Correct. Would do, right? Correct, so it depends on the program. So the LPN program is a standalone nursing program, meaning that you don't have to have been one of our high school students to get into this program. You can enter just as an adult, same with the other programs. What's different about the nursing, if it was CNA or LNA, licensed nursing assistant or certified nursing assistants, those are very similar to our high school programs. It's the same curriculum. It's just offered at a faster pace for adults so that we can get them in and out into the workforce at a quicker to meet the demands. Yeah. So if a high school student goes through their program as high school, they graduate, can they move on to this one to help them yes. more? So if you come to EVA as a high school student and you do the CNA program or medical assisting or other health program, you can then transition to the LPN program upon graduation. And this program is about 11 months long. So a year after graduating high school, they can be out working in the nursing field as a nurse, as a licensed practical nurse. Wow, that's amazing. Um, okay, so let's say if someone's watching right now, what do you recommend to them to do if they want to get involved with Yvette? I, I would say come on down. We have recruiters here on campus during the day, Monday through Friday on the school days. Check out the website. Really come take a tour and look at the different opportunities, not only that we have for the high school students, but also the adult students. I think Eve, it's a secret. I don't know why it's a secret. I think it's shocking to people to find out we have so many adult programs, but it's a great avenue for a lot of students. Not everybody is set for the traditional route of a community college or um, university level. This gets them into the workforce with the certification they need to be making money at a much quicker way, yeah. rate. Well, I gotta say, Rhonda, actually, when you come to this campus, I feel like I'm on a, a major college atmosphere without that pressure, which is really great. So when you do visit here, I, I mean, I'm very shocked at all the buildings and new activities and new things going on here that it, it keeps up with what we're seeing going out into yes. the real world. So we're very privileged to EVIT that we have a large campus and we have um, lots of buildings and lots of equipment. And the beauty of this is EVIT was, has been paid for with taxpayer funding money for the high school students. We're taking those revenues and those um, acquisitions that we got from the taxpayer and maximizing them, allowing adults to come in and use that same space. So it's really saving our taxpayers and our community money by using this space when it's not being used by high school students. Yeah. Well, Ron, I'll tell you, this place is amazing. So where can people find more information if they want to become a student here, either high school or an adult? So the best place to go is the website or to come on down. We have recruiters here Monday through Friday during school hours that are available and are happy to meet with adult students or high school students who want to take a tour and look at what we offer here at EVIT and see how it fits into their life and how it can help them. Great. And the website is? The website is evit.com. There it is. Thanks Thank for you. having us here. Thank you so much. Thank you. There you have it right there. If you're looking to expand your education, either high school or adult, that's the place for you.